Hi, Cormac here from the TrackX team. In this video, I'm going to show you some of the features of the media browser. This is the area where you find the media that you want to use to create your video. To preview a piece of media, simply click on it once. It will now play in the video output window. If the file is long, let's say a video clip, use the seek bar to move to different areas of the clip to preview. When previewing audio, use the volume slider to control the volume. To start working with a piece of media, drag it into the mixing window. To edit a section, drag it from the media browser onto a tab in the track cutter, the editing tool. You can drag multiple clips onto tabs in the track cutter for editing. To view thumbnails of the media on your drives, right click on a file or folder and select View in Media Manager. The Media Manager window will appear. This window can be adjusted in size and moved. Use a thumbnail slider to control the size of the thumbnails. Again, drag and drop the media you want to use into the mixing window or track cutter. You can select multiple media clips and folders and drag them directly into the mixing window. A paste options window will appear, giving you complete control on how this media will be pasted into the mixing window. If you have folders with a lot of images, you can create an automatic slideshow from within the media browser. Right click on the folder with the images and select Create Slideshow. The slideshow window will appear. Click play to preview the slideshow. Using the sliders, you can control the length of both the images and the crossfade between them. You can add effects by right clicking in the effect boxes. Position the play bar where you want the slideshow to be placed and select send to mix. In the scan tab you can search your drives and folders for specific file formats. The recent files tab shows you the files you've been working with recently. Again use the thumbnail slider to adjust the size of the thumbnails. 